You serious? I was thinking London, Manchester, but with me. Well, that's the idea, yeah. You know, if you'd have asked me this a few weeks ago, I'd have my bags packed right now. And just forget the last couple of weeks. I mean, nothing's changed. Not really. Except I know you don't mean it. You don't have the guts. No, you're wrong. This is what I want. It's what we both want. So I've got nothing left to lose. Exactly. So you'll come with me? Why don't you go in that bar, buy us both a drink, and then when you're in there, tell them all exactly what you are? <sighs> Aaron, don't play games. No, if, you, if you're serious, go in the bar and say it proud. Tell them you're gay. You can't even be honest with yourself, let alone anyone else. What does it matter? I'm asking you to come with me. It's a fresh start together. Why do you think I asked Chrissy to take you back and admitted that I was involved in that raid? I didn't do it for you. No, fine, it doesn't matter. I just wanted you out of my face. This, this is even better. So do you know what? Take your little payoff and do one. Does this mean what we think it means? I'm leaving. Chris is taking you back? Um, pretty much the opposite. So I guess I'm done here. Robert, I'm sorry. No, you can't go, not like this. Vic's right, you can't be making these kinds of decisions when you're upset. But I'll give you a call in a couple of days when I've figured out the next move. What, so you're gonna go without even saying goodbye to Andy? You seemed so positive earlier. Do you wanna talk about it? I've messed up. It's over. She's made that pretty clear, so I don't really think there's much left to talk about. Chad sent me through. You all right? I've had better days. I'll be in the bar if you need me. Maybe you can try where we failed. Persuade him to stick around. Do some good for once. Wait, you're leaving? Yeah. I don't believe it. This is all my fault because of what I did to Alicia. Hey, I promise you, none of this is your fault, all right? I've pushed Mum to the brink. I saw what she was going to do to you with those petrol cans. She's lost it and it's all because of me. There was never any petrol in that can. She was never going to hurt me. You didn't know that. Maybe she needs help too. Well, she's angry, that's all. She's, she's just trying to scare me. Why? What have you done that's so bad? I mean, for Mum to do something like that can't have been worse than what I did. Well, I, I've, I've made some mistakes too, and, you know, now it's time for me to move on. Don't go. Your Mum loves you more than anyone else in the world, you know that. She loves you too, I know she does. I'm sorry, Lachlan. I just don't think she's going to be able to forgive me. So that's it then? You're just going to give up? And I thought you actually wanted to be with us. I do. I do, Lachlan. I can't. I can help fix whatever's happened. <sighs> I wish it were that easy. <laughs> First my dad, now you. I mean, I should have known better with him and his promises, but you. You're the closest thing to a proper dad that I've ever known. And now you're just going to leave me too. 